quick pit stop to get some diesel here at the co-op. A little diesel in the truck. She's thirsty. And then yeah, we'll hit the road here. Good morning everyone. It's uh, just before 8 o'clock here. I've been driving for a little while. I'm on my way to Lloyd Minster. I am uh, I'm getting my new sled today. Super excited. I've been waiting a little while to pick this sled up. I've been busy, I've been working up north, and I uh, haven't had a chance to drive out and get it yet. So today's the day. Truck just got out of the shop yesterday. We got a full delete, so uh, just testing it out. Nice little three and a half hour drive with some cold temps to uh, test her out, I guess. So yeah. Just pulling into Lloyd now. Uh, gonna pull up to Rec Tech, sign some papers. Gonna get a bunch of accessories and oil, and then uh, we're gonna hit the road back to PA and try and get back in decent time. We're here. Picked up my new 2023 Skidoo Expert Turbo, uh, 154 3 inch. I'm pumped. The thing looks awesome. Huge thanks to uh, Rectech for getting me in this thing on short notice. Looks so good. I got so much stuff in my sled. Got the back seat full. Had to get a dolly to carry all of my oil. So, yeah, the secret's out now. I, uh, I bought myself a 23 Skidoo uh, Expert Turbo 154. Originally, Mark and I, we had snow check Polaris's this past spring. Uh, I ordered a 9R, Mark ordered an 850 Chaos Slash. Of course, as everyone knows, Polaris is unable to uh, deliver their suds this year. They're having uh, supply chain issues and uh, they're on their second stop right now. So our sleds, Mark's sled was supposed to be in time for our trip in December, but the second stop ride uh, has it pushed back to be determined, and uh, we don't know when it's going to come. Mine was uh, mid-January to end of January, so it wouldn't have worked for my trip. However, Mark and I had to do what was in our best interest. Um, I couldn't be waiting for a sled if it was going to come or when. Um, this one is at the dealer, Mark's is at the dealer. So we pulled the trigger and we both got to do expert turbos. So we're excited to ride those this year. It'll be a huge upgrade over our, our uh, 2015 XMs that we had. So looking forward to it. I just wanna say a huge thanks to Rectech and Lloyd. Um, they were able to get me into this expert turbo um, kind of last minute. So I'm really grateful that they're able to do that for me. Their staff was awesome to deal with. Um, they are really helpful through the whole process. They have a really nice dealership actually with a bunch of different stuff in it and accessories. I actually bought my CFR risers, some grips. Uh, they have Munster products there, so they, they literally have everything you need to uh, get your sled ready for the season. Even if you like aftermarket, they have cans and stuff too. So yeah, go check them out if you're looking for a sled, tell them I sent you. My apologies if I did a, a pretty poor job filming when I got, first got the sled. I was super excited, I was jittery. Uh, yeah, like a kid in the candy store on Christmas. It was unreal. So happy. It looks way, the, the look's actually really starting to grow on me. At first, I was like, ah, it doesn't look the greatest. But now that I've seen it more in person, it's really growing on me. I, I like the look of it. It should be a pretty rowdy sled. Uh, I've been watching videos on Facebook and YouTube, and these things look absolutely rowdy. So we've got a couple things in the works for this thing. Uh, I'll be putting some risers, monster finger throttle on it. 
Um, just a couple accessories, nothing big, USB plug. I didn't get the screen on this one. Um, I would have got the screen, but the one they had, the one turbo they had available, it didn't have it, so I took it. No complaints here though. So now that I picked up my sled, I guess I might as well announce this now. Um, I'm going to be going to Revelstoke and living there for a month this winter. I'll be taking off right after Christmas. We'll be leaving on the 27th and then I'll be there for the month of January. I've been wanting to do this for a very long time. I just, however, with university and uh, everything, I, I wasn't able to get away. Some people might ask how I'm able to do this. To be honest, I worked a lot this summer. Like, I worked my butt off, saved, saved a lot of money and uh, saved my holidays, banked all my overtime, and just made things work. It's awesome to see things are starting to come together. I got the place booked, um, I got my sled, I just got my truck deleted, uh, I got all my accessories and stuff, so I, I basically just gotta wait until it's time to leave and uh, go rip it, excited. Mark and my dad will be coming down to Revelstoke too. They'll be riding for maybe four days uh, right after Christmas. And then uh, they'll take off and it'll be just me there. So I plan on uh, trying to meet people in the parking lot and seeing if uh, if people got room for a plus one or uh, if you guys see me on social media, just reach out. I'm always looking for people to ride with. Um, I plan to film, put a video out every day and uh, just film my whole, whole experience and adventure. It's been something I want to do for a long time, so yeah, it'll be a learning experience for me. I've ridden in the mountains since 2015, and uh, ever since then I've been addicted. Myself and Mark have been doing like YouTube and filming and stuff since 2020, so we've been doing it for a couple years now. Been really big into drones and doing that kind of stuff. Um, we haven't really done vlog style videos as much, but it's something we've always, we've kind of started to get into and uh, try our hand at, so bear with us. We're trying to get better at it. Mark showed off his new sled that he got there this week. Um, I got mine today. it guys the new gen 5 is all unloaded looks unreal Well, I can't wait anymore. I'm gonna go out and take this thing for a rip. It's snowing a bit right now. So yeah, I'll catch you in the next vid. Just wanna say a huge thanks to Rec Tech and Lloyd. They were really helpful and uh, it was awesome buying experience. So definitely gonna go back to them in the future. Thanks for watching. If you guys liked the video, give it a like and subscribe. Leave a comment maybe too. It helps us out a lot. And uh, yeah, I'll keep the side content coming. So cheers, we'll catch you guys later.